Okay, Akumaldo Crypto here. Hi guys. Um, here we have my one hour chart. Okay, Bitcoin. Um, so, as we have been talking about this whole movement here that we have, we has, it has been contained in this pitchfork. Okay, this pitchfork, as you can see, has uh, contained the whole movement and we are now touching it at the top of it you can see it right and we have some things here yeah we have a we it has touched the top of the the pitch fork and the 200 dma is acting as a resistance and the the 100 dma now is going to acting as a support what i'm proposing here is that we have an impulse motive impulse wave okay it does look like a lot of motive impulse wave, right? If we measure it, this is the extension. Here we have the one extended to the two. Right on the spot, 10618, 175 for our wave three. It's like the sweet spot for our wave three. So it does look like it's a wave three indeed. Um, it's difficult, guys, now to to say something different. I, I don't know. This is what I'm proposing, okay, guys? That we have this five waves going up, okay? Which will form in uh, which accordingly will form an A, okay? A wave, B, and a C to form this two. What I'm proposing is that, is that we have finished the wave one of that whole structure going down just, uh, just yesterday. This was yesterday? Yes. Just yesterday. Okay, we finished it yesterday, touching this blue line in the, on, the, uh, on the pitchfork, but then we are now uh, correcting to form this wave two. Okay, why... Did I change my count? First of all, because it structure, the structure of the movement looks a lot better like this, and we need to take the structure of the movement into consideration. Okay, and that wave two here. Let's see in a daily chart. Sorry, the that wave two here was like nothing. Remember, I was saying, oh, this wave one. Okay, now if we look at this. Let me take this blue here, this blue trend line. If you look at this one, now it seems that it's finished. Okay, and then we are now starting to form a wave two. Okay, so then we can have a, a nice symmetrical wave two that is uh, proportional to the wave one. Okay, that has at least 50% of the wave one that we would get to the, to perhaps to the six five percent here of this whole movement this is a strong resistance really strong resistance okay i'm proposing that we are going to go up to at least uh, six six let, let, let me see at the one hour um yeah something like here perhaps seven thousand yes why not seven thousand okay perhaps seven thousand six nine hundred okay for our wave two then the structure here would be way better okay we would have a a different structure sorry for this we have a way different structure if remember uh if we swing we get our fib retracement here and we swing this highest point here that our that's our x okay to the lowest which is our Y, we have those algo targets, okay? Oopsie, sorry. So again, this is the, the, the highest point of X, and I swing the highest point to the lowest, okay? Then we have those targets here. This is our Y here, X, then we are going down. Assuming that we are going down, we have minus 360% here, minus 32%. 33 20 percent what is our algo target guys it's really simple when someone sold when someone or an algo a, a, a 
machine sold at 50%. They, it's, it's, it, 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 we, we didn't get at the 50%. You see, we tried to get at the 50%, but we failed. But they started selling it at the 38, 20%, and they failed to, to reach the 50%. They tried. But then now they are going to start buying at the minus 33, 60%, minus 38, 20%, if we get to, this, to those levels. If. It's a huge if. I am proposing that we might get there, but we might as well not break this blue line here, guys. Okay, we tried, but we haven't yet. We formed this kind of support here. Okay, we formed this kind of a trend line here. We we have some uh, some more touches here if we want. If you guys are really really into finding the the touches and. Uh, having more than three and four so here we have our trend line okay and we now have a two a wave two okay i don't think we have strength to break it now without retracing enough so then we can have a uh, power to uh, full to give uh, uh, full to the bears to get down here okay it's that's what i'm proposing guys that's why i changed my count here at the one hour okay i changed because it makes a lot of sense we have now one two now we have the symmetry one two three four five finish the three four this is a four here nice four because we have a running flat a b c for our blue four then we finish our five here put a one the whole one wave is contained in this uh pitchfork so probably now the ABC, the wave two is gonna bridge out of this pitchfork. This is what I'm waiting. Okay, this is this looks like a, just as I explained. This looks like a one, two, three, four, five to finish our way. Then we would have a B and a C. Okay. So in order to do that, we need to break the 200 EMA here, and the 100 EMA needs to work as a resist as a support here. Okay, those two lines here. This is uh, yet to be seen, right? We need to be paying close attention, but this is my account, uh, and this looks a lot better than what I had before, okay? Weekly chart, guys, amazing, right? Because, again, we try to break this, one, uh, this trend blue line here, again, and we failed. Okay, it seems that we are trying to break it. So perhaps we are gonna see something like this. Who knows, right? Something like this, if I'm proposing a wave two. And then we are gonna try again, perhaps. Or perhaps we are gonna go and touch the, the blue line here at the top. This would be 7,600. But what we see is rejection, rejection. Every time that we try to touch this trend blue line here, we have a rejection. Okay, the, um, let me see the, this is the greenish, yeah. Yeah, this is the eight. Yeah, we are pretty much below all the EMAs, right? All the EMAs. Yes, this is weekly chart and we are below everything. We don't have any EMA offering support, but instead, of course, this is the, the 100 and this the 200 EMA. They are offering support, but we try to touch the 100 here, but but, but we, we traced before it, yeah? We, uh, this blue line here is really strong. If we break it, it's gonna be like a, 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 a crucial moment for Bitcoin, okay? Um, and the 55 EMA here is this red line here. This is gonna act as a really strong resistance as well. This is gonna be 7300. So let's see where we get, right? Because this red line is gonna turn a little bit down, okay, as we progress. It's too soon to, to call anything here, but what I'm saying is that I believe and I feel that what we have is that this four five waves going up okay if we measure it by the way this wave four here's this wave four here has retraced 38 20 percent okay 
which is a, a fairly good spot for a wave four, you see, right in the the sweet spot here, 38, 20 percent. Okay, right on it. Right on it appears here, and we, we had what a, a reaction, right? So this is really, really fun, isn't it? If this is in play, if this is indeed in play, we are gonna have an A here, which is gonna be a nice thing. Eh? I, I, I am putting here at the 618 for our wave A here. Then we are gonna, we trace to our wave B, then this is gonna be another story. Our wave B is gonna, um, is gonna retest some previous resistance as support. So I am, uh, this is, wave B probably is gonna break this resistance here again, and then we are gonna have a B that's like here, where we are now, by the way. Then we are gonna have a C. A lot, a lot might happen uh, if this count is possible, because a lot of people is gonna be fighting for this wave two here. It's an important wave, right? Always waves, waves two. We have the opportunity, uh, the opportunity of a lot of profits. Okay. Um, so that's the overall picture. This is my one-hour chart. This is the, this is my Bitcoin update, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, like and subscribe. Uh, now I have a Discord group. It's growing. It's really fun. Uh, you have access to my 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 all-in-one suite of indicators. <laughs> it's gonna help you a lot. And there you have a lot of people that can help you and me as well. And uh, thanks again. I always enjoy the filming it. And that's it. We see each other later. Cheers. Bye-bye.